Yo guys, Benji here back again with another video. Um, if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you will be updated with my videos. And for the video for today, we will do a unboxing video. Um, so recently, my girlfriend bought a gaming laptop. MSI gaming laptop. I'm sure maybe all of you guys heard about that company or most of you heard about them so this laptop is around 16.49 retail price um canadian price okay so we will do unboxing of this laptop and let's see how good it is because specification wise it has an i7 processor, Intel Core i7 9750H, 16GB DDR4 RAM. I forgot the speed. I think, if I'm not mistaken, 2666MHz of speed for the RAM. Um, it has a 512... This is what I've read. It has a 512 NVMe SSD, right? Because there's a regular SATA or SATA in in Canada, SATA SSD, and the NVMe non-volatile memory express that's powered through PCIe. Okay, so this one is NVMe SSD. As far. That's what I've read and this one has a RTX 2060 that's why it's it's a crazy laptop it's not really like the fastest out there but it's it's good right my girlfriend bought it she plays League of Legends but as soon as she bought this one she asked me if this will work with Fortnite I told her absolutely if this will work with I know she asked me about COD, so I checked the specifications for um, specifications for COD Modern Warfare because I know it needs high graphics and yeah, it should work fine. And there's one more game that she asked me, but I I forgot. But I know it will play. Oh, Dota 2. I don't know why she asked me that. She doesn't play Dota 2, at least. I don't know if she played Dota in the past before, but I don't know why she asked me. And I told her it will work. Okay, so this is the one right here. Um, so before I begin opening this one, um, I will speak in English so that other nationalities can understand what I'm saying as well. So for my Filipino fans, bear with me. I, I just I just want to show it to and explain it to um, other people as well. Because if I speak in Tagalog, it, they cannot understand it. Okay, if just comment down below if you have any questions. But this is the laptop. It's still in the box. This is not the laptop, but it's inside. It's inside. Okay. So first of all, I don't know why MSI do this one. I think it's for the uh, device. I think it's a device protection thing that they that they do the double box on this one because this, as you can see, this is a brown box. MSI box, brown box. If you open inside, I'm hundred percent sure it has another box inside, red and black, most likely. I know because I work in, I work where she bought this one. So I saw a lot of MSI. It's this packaging. Maybe not all models or not, yeah, not all models, but I, I don't know why, but I think it's, it's a safety for the shipments. If they ship the laptops, they have double the protection. Right, so I guess you, you pay for that as well. Like the double box. Let me get scissors so I can cut it right so 
That's one thing that I observe. I think it's it's part of the box making a sound or charger. I think so. Okay. So I will open this one. My girlfriend really wants to use this, right? Like right now. So I'm like, okay, I'll I'll make a video and then you use it. Okay, let's open this. It's brand new, like brand new sealed. Oh shoot. Okay. I cannot cut properly. See, I'll show you. Okay. First box. The brown box. As I told you, if you open this one. There is another box, and I'm I'm right. It's a black and red box by MSI. Right? Nice packaging. Um, oh, just so you know, I'll give you the model number. So this one is a GF six five nine SEXR dash four three six CA. Okay, I'll write it down over here so you will see. Yeah, it's the thin MSI GF65 Thin 9 SEXR. Okay, yep. Yeah. And I believe RTX 2060 is 6 gig. I believe so. Okay, let's see this bad boy. This is pricey, but. I think it's the best one. Oh, oh, interesting. Oh, wow. Because usually if you open the brown box and then take out the other box, there's another seal on the inside box. But this one doesn't have any seals. No seals. Nothing. That's why I'm looking for the seal so I can open it. But there's no seals. Okay, let's let's go and open this one. Oh, uh, screen size, I believe it's a fifteen point six. I'm pretty sure it's fifteen point six. You can just Google the the model number, but I know it's fifteen point six. Oof. Oof. Look at that. Okay, you always get this MSI thing. Stop contact info. Yeah, we are here to help. Should you have any questions about your gaming notebook? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, that's the one. Let's go with the charger first. The side box. I'm not sure if you can see me properly, but that's oh, let's put it here closer. Okay. So side box side of the box you will see a power cord. Yeah, just a just a regular three pin. On the other side is a bit like three circular pins. It's not it's not like the regular pin that we use here in Canada to be specific. Because I know other in other countries there's different plugins. So that's the laptop. Just it's always like this that they put a cloth protection and yeah, on yeah over the laptop, and then they put the plastic. So let's remove the plastic first. Okay, let's remove this box here. Oops, sorry guys, it's gonna be messy. Okay, they have another piece of paper. I'm pretty sure this is. I don't know. Oh, quick start guide notebook by MSI in different languages. I will not bother about that. And that's the huge charger, the power block. There's another. There's another part over here that you can just take a flap for the box. But there's nothing on it. It's empty. It's nothing inside. Okay, so. Oh, one more thing guys, I just want to tell you that this video, 
It's not for MSI. It's not sponsored by MSI. It's not sponsored by anybody. This is um, my personal decision to do this unboxing video to show you guys. Maybe it will help you for those people who want to buy a gaming laptop. Right? Not MSI specifically. That's why I'm, I'm just showing you. I'm not sh doing this for MSI. Okay? Anyway, let's continue with the video. <laughs> so, I need to plug this in. It's huge power block, eh? So, yeah. AC input is 100 to 240 volts. So, it's it's good because I know here in Canada, it's 110. Back in the Philippines and other Asian countries, I believe, is 220. So, we'll... It should work. The only thing that you need to buy is the adapter. The end adapters, because I know in the Philippines it's different, and I think it's Euro in Europe it's different, in UK it's different. I'm not too sure, but this is based on on my personal experience because I I work in an electronics store, and then a lot of customers ask me if we sell the um, travel adapters. Because they live in different parts of the world or they came from different parts of the world. So that's why based on that I'm saying that. So you know when you buy this. Let's plug this in. Um, let's find over here. I have a lot of plugins over here. I have one power bar, power bar on my right side and another um, extension on my left side. But the one on the left side is full so I'll go with this. Okay. Okay, so I'll remove the box so it's not it will not be in our way over here and it will not block me. Perfect, let's put it down. I'm not sure if you can still see me. I think you can. Let's grab the laptop here. There you go. Oh it's nice. Yeah, definitely 15.6. I can tell right away. Oh, it's nice though. This is funny, eh? So, I just pulled it out from the cloth wrap or wrapper or bag. And there's fingerprints. So, I pulled it out over here. And then I grab it over here. And then there's a lot of fingerprints. I'm not sure if you can see f from that end, but a lot of fingerprints over here. That's weird. To be honest, I've seen this with with other products as well. I think with f Samsung phones as well. Brand new Samsung sealed. When I opened it, there's fingerprints. I don't know why. I don't want to say something, but I don't know why. Okay, so. Let's see if we can remove the fingerprints. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can, you can. Yeah, it's a fingerprints, you can remove it. So, based on this look, I'm looking at this one. It's, I thought this a thin plastic that you can still remove. Oh, I think you can. Yeah, yeah so there's a thin plastic to cover the, the top side. Right, so that's why you can still, you see like, it's, it's shiny. Right, because there's still plastic on it. I don't want to remove it because it's a, it's a protection for the laptop and it's my girlfriend's laptop. That's why. I don't wanna. I don't wanna, remove it as long as, it's good and it's protecting it and then it's good. Okay. So when you open it, it gives you, the cloth for the keyboard. Nice keyboard. Like, oh, that's good. Like MSI is known for black and red right so that's why the keyboard is red and then it's black and then when you turn it on there's a red back light on it so let's see i7 ninth generation sticker by intel and geforce rtx all right so what i'll do i'll plug it in and then i'll show you guys how fast this is 
Okay guys, so this is the laptop. I'm molding my camera. The plugin is on the left side of the laptop. Alright, usually it's over here on the right side, but it's on the left side. Doesn't doesn't really matter, but it's good to know as well. Okay, so that's the power button, let's turn it on. Yeah, so that's that's a common or natural MSI what do you call this? Maybe MSI design. Right? The red and black keyboard with the red backlight on it. So right now I turned it on. It might take a bit of time right now because I just turned it on then you need to set it up and things like that. So let's wait for this one and then I will um, finish yeah I will finish all of these. I'll make my account or I'll put my, I'll put my girlfriend's account. Then I will reset the phone or oh, the phone sorry I'll reset the laptop I'm holding a phone that's why I'm sorry so I'll reset the laptop and then and then um, let's see how fast it boots up right and and let's see how it performs okay I'll see you in a bit guys okay guys so I just finished setting this one up so I will shut it down let's see how quick this will be so shut down Let's see, and let's wait until the keyboard light perfect goes off. There you go. So turning it off, I would say around five ten seconds, which is good. Let's turn it back on here. There you go, turned on. Perfect. There you go. So I would say booting up time will be around 10 to 15 seconds. It depends on the laptop. It depends on how many files as well you have over here. So let me just see. Okay, so I just connected our Wi-Fi. So let's go to browser Microsoft Edge. Okay, let's just go with one tab and then let's go to youtube.com and let's see how fast it loads depends on the Wi-Fi as well guys just so you know it's not bad loading up I know our Wi-Fi is not too fast as well let's open one video and see how fast it will load and how good is the video as proud Nova Scotians we are incredibly saddened by the tragedy that took place in our community yeah, skip ads Okay, so okay, no things. Okay, so this one over here. Let's see the resolution as well on this. It's only a 720p. So that's high definition. Let's see. Oh yeah. So you can let's change it to full high definition. Do you know what Easter is? <laughs> it's where a yeah. bunny comes around and leaves eggs everywhere. <laughs> It's pretty good. <laughs> a bunny goes around leaving Loading up everywhere. good. Depends on the Wi Fi as well. Audio is pretty good as well. Built in audio. Except right. not eggs. Pretty good. <laughs> you can have a waffle hunt. Right. Yeah. Okay, that's good. And I think um, the screen is 120 hertz on this, on this laptop. Right, so. Yeah, so the I believe that's good to go. And then when you one more thing is when you turn this on, there is I think this is the one that I pressed. I think it's a gaming mode for MSI that it gives you different options on on how you will use your laptop. Is it for gaming, for watching mu uh, movies? Is it for I think making videos, things like that? And then do you want the battery life to be longer do you want to balance the power and the battery life things like that it will show you those options and then you can just choose and then whatever you prefer then you're good right so i think that's it oh one more thing is 
you can hear the fan on this one right I'm not sure if you can hear it but I'll to make like I'll put it closer all right so if you can hear that that's the fan like it's not too loud it's just a regular fan noise that you can hear but a while ago it it went a bit crazy and the fan I don't know what happened but the fan it went loud louder than this right now right and then I check one more thing underneath of this laptop you know you know some laptops you can you can see like the easy access places or sections for the RAM for the hard drive so you can change it you can upgrade them on this one I cannot see anything it's just a it's just the whole panel so if you want to change it you need to remove the whole panel but remember you will see you will void the warranty if you do that unless you're out of warranty then just take the risk right and then one more thing I saw is heat sinks so we have heat sinks over here if I'm not mistaken maybe there's like five or six uh, yeah maybe five or six heat sinks over here I think there's two three four five six yeah right so that's the one there you go and then on the side you have the charger port one HDMI over here on the other side give me one sec on the other side Oops, sorry. On the other side, you you have the headphone and microphone combo jack, All right? So you can plug in the microphone as well over here. And then you have two USB. I believe it's a 3.0, maybe 3.1 or 3.2. And then you have USB Cs over here. You have two USB Cs, the Ethernet port, so you can plug in the cable, and you have a faster connection internet connection right yeah yeah so that's it for this laptop guys and it depends on the games that you play but as I said like lower end games will give you more frames per second higher end games will give you lesser frames per second it depends on how good the specifications of that you have of the laptop right so that's one more thing so I don't want to do that because I know it depends on specs and games which is which right so it can be 60 frames 30 frames 120 frames per second but maybe based on my on my um, experience a uh, League of Legends might give you on this laptop maybe 120 frames per second right because a GTX 1050 it goes up to like 60 frames so this one might give you 120 frames per second or higher right and then you can enjoy the game and good and have good graphics okay guys so that's the unboxing video for this MSI laptop over here okay guys so um that's the video for today and i hope you guys learned something i hope you guys oh i hope this video will help you in the future if you're buying a gaming laptop on what laptop to get on what specifications that you need right so i would suggest um search it on google the name of your game if you're if you're or if you're a gamer the name of your game system requirements so you know what you need or what you, yeah exactly so you know what you need to buy right what specs you need to buy I always check that sometimes it's not true but it's good to have an idea so you will not make a mistake and buy the wrong laptop right so 
um, again, I want to say thank you guys for watching this video. Um, if you like this video, give this video a huge thumbs up, comment down below, share my videos, subscribe to my channel, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you will be updated with my videos. To all my Filipino viewers, if you have any questions, comment down below. I will answer you in English or Tagalog. I'm sorry if I, I did English on this video. I just wanted to be shared to everyone. And it's easier to understand English rather than people translating Tagalog to English. Right? And as I always say, wherever you are in the world, you guys have a good day, have a good night, have a good afternoon. God bless. You guys take care always. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace, 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 peace out.